Hi, my name is Brian Schieser and I'm here from Trellis at the Heathman Hotel in Kirkland, Washington to talk a little bit about how to know when your burger's done in the skillet. Now often we think of cooking burgers on the grill um, or on the barbecue. Um, we don't always have a barbecue, so if you're making burgers at home and um, you're not grilling outside, um, one of the most important techniques to remember is to keep your temperature low. You don't want to cook them at a very high heat. Um, you're going to start out with a well-seasoned burger patty. You get your skillet hot. Take your skillet, get it hot on the stove, put your burger into the skillet, let it cook very slowly. Very important not to squeeze the burger because if you squeeze the burger with your spatula or with your tongs, you're going to push all those beautiful, valuable juices out. So we want to remember medium to low heat, have your burger go in, let it cook very great on one side if you want to get a little bit of a darker color. So this is on a lower heat, you heat it up, turn your heat up and you can get a little bit of a darker color at the very end. Um, also a technique is when you're finished, you can use a cover, put your cheese over the burgers and then put a lid on the skillet and let the cheese melt a little bit slower. Shut your heat off, the steam from the burger will melt down your cheese. And then the most important part is a thermometer, either a digital thermometer or a regular oven thermometer. And you have three burgers. We have three burgers in the pan. We have um, a rare burger, which I put a little bit of um, Swiss cheese on. We have a medium burger and a well done burger. So rare, we want 100 to 100, 120 to 125 degrees for our rare burger. We want 145 degrees for our medium burger and 160 degrees for our well done burger. Now if you don't have a thermometer, this is, uh, if you take your hand and you hold your hand out and your finger here with your hand nice and loose and if you touch this area here, that's what a rare burger should feel like. If you turn your hand over and you touch your palm here, it's a little bit firmer. That would be what a medium burger would feel like. And if you stretch your hand back so your palm's nice and tight, right there by your thumb, that would be what a well done burger feels like. So burgers in a skillet at home, low heat, low to medium heat, high heat at the end if you want to get a little bit of color a lid on top if you want to melt your cheese and rule of thumb for temperatures you're going to start out with your rare, your medium and your well done 160 degrees for well done 145 degrees for medium and 120 to 25 degrees for rare. This is Brian at Trellis at the Heathman Hotel in Kirkland and how to cook the perfect burger in a skillet.